Good afternoon, everybody. This is Bob Aicino of Path Trading Partners, along with my co-founder, Mike Arnold. It is June 26th. This is a cryptocurrency update. This is more or less a, a teaching moment rather than an update. Mike noticed another pattern. If you look back on our YouTube channel, you'll see a video on some head and shoulders patterns. You'll also see us being about five for five in the trades we called out. But the reason is, is these patterns that we trade, we trade them differently than the traditional way. They may have traditional names, but we have what we call adjusted price action analysis. And this is a clear head and shoulders pattern. Now there's a specific way to trade these where it makes sense. Mike can't go into all of the details and all the rules of the way that we trade it, but we thought we'd give you an update here and show you kind of what is likely to happen if this head and shoulder pattern were to be triggered. It is there, it doesn't have to trigger. We see a lot of people asking why things are moving and we say, why do you care? All you really know, need to know is what is happening rather than why it's happening. So without going on and on about it, let me turn it over to Mike and he can let you know the way that we are looking at this particular pattern in Bitcoin. Mike, it is all yours. Okay, thank you very much, Bob. Bitcoin, big picture potential trade. Traders, if you're willing to short it, this is a huge head and shoulders pattern on the daily that has not triggered yet. Right now, we are holding at the 50-day exponential moving average. We're watching for a close below this neckline. We need a close below this neckline. If we do, the major downside targets are going to be about this 1842 level, which is the prior breakout zone back in May. You see here's a prior breakout zone, so that would be what target? About 75% target. 1617, which is the bottom of this uh, breakout zone we just talked about before it rocketed up on this leg. And then the full target, should this play out to go to full target, about 1392, which is just above this breakout zone, which could take the Bitcoin price back to levels that were trading on May 1st of 2017. So if this does trigger and the pattern plays out as it tends to many times, you could see prices all the way back to that level and it would not surprise us. People might say it's crashing, it's what's going on with Bitcoin. Look how far Bitcoin's run up. These patterns can trigger and just take it back to these other key levels. Just wanted to point that out. This is an upward sloping neckline, which is what we want to see. We need to close below the neckline. Now, if it takes a while to close below this neckline, then these prices will shift a little bit because we will have to re we reproject them but they won't shift that much and if it does trade back above this uh right hand shoulder then the pattern is now invalid that's all i have for you turning it back over to you bob thanks for that michael if you're interested in what we do go to pathtradingpartners.com there's a lot more information there on what we do also episode 77 of the money path podcast is out we do talk about cryptocurrencies in the podcast we do have a cryptocurrency segment where we talk about some of the things that we see going on you can find it at pathtradingpartners.com or type in the money path podcast into itunes or google play Cheers. Thanks for watching and hit like and subscribe if you like what we're doing or reach out to us at pathtrainingpartners.com or leave a comment under the video. Cheers, everyone. Mm -hmm.